Caught by Strahd, who took his bot. And we're back. Nice pile of you. What uh? Um, I'm a puddle. <laughs> I'm a sad puddle. All right. I'm gonna wing down. <laughs> this is your brain on drugs. <laughs> that that real. off was a bad yes. idea. Eisenschmidt. Yes. And Imch. Ooh. You feel comfortable. Your, like when when you die, you feel um, the connection sever from. Yeah. We feel this sight of Strahd. Forms, and you find yourself fucking back where we started. In a, a, a kind of a dark area. This is Rape Dungeon. You don't see anyone else. But a mold covered ceiling hangs three feet above the still black water that fills this corridor. The water is five feet deep. We're standing in it? Uh, you are in, uh, you're in these, like, elevated chair things that have your head above water. So we're sitting. Uh, you're sitting. Are we restrained? Or you grappled? are not restrained. Is cool. our equipment on so we're still? Your equipment is not on you. We're sitting naked or just, like, rags? Um, you are in, yeah, kind of like prison. Prison guard. Rags. My bare form or half work form? You are uh, just when woke you up. go unconscious. He goes back to half orc. You, you are you are back to half orc form. <clears throat> nice. Um, do all of you have dark vision? Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Dark elf. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he has super dark vision. <laughs> we have like kind of kind of regular. Can well, first thing, you don't know how long you've been in this water. Yeah. But when you hold your hands up, they're pruny. You're, you're real pruny. We're yeah. Pruny. <laughs> you're real pruny. You guys are so pruny. Um, yes, pruny. You're like old men. <laughs> in front of you, these are these are ten foot. It was when you guys was the pruny. Sure <laughs> <I'm laughs> right. Yeah. These are ten foot by ten foot cells, and of course the front of which is iron bars. Or uh, some kind of metal. Are we in one prison cell, or are we uh, in a hallway? You are. You are in individual cells. Individual cells. Are they connected? Can I see either um, of them? They are. No, you can't. Like you're. And I'll just say hello. You're in the same <laughs> room. I'm here. Uh, from I'm one work. of the other cells, you hear a gruff voice. Who's there? Uh, drunk guy waking up. <laughs> no, this is. Uh, this is not where I parked my wagon. <laughs> I just this woke is up. Not where I left my horse. <laughs> that just makes me think. Of my I'll kind of stand up on the chair and kind of get a feel for where I am. Why are you here? Because I just woke up. Uh, who are you? I'm a local. <laughs> that doesn't answer my question. <laughs> yes. I'm Terrell. I'm Emil. Emil. I am Emil, Terrell. Who are you? Emil Tornes. Who are you? <laughs> he you just said Emil Tordinesco. How'd you get here? Yeah, how'd you get here? Strahd imprisoned me. So oh, I what'd guess. You do? Uh, I stirred up a schism in my pack. Pack? What pack. manner of beast are you? Can can I can I make sure can I like maybe use like some insight make sure that he's this is like. He's not tricking us or yeah, something. Yeah, this isn't a trick or some sort. Yeah, give me a side check. Nope. nope. Okay. Not a trick. <laughs> Cleared. <laughs> we are okay. Interesting. I'm good at insight. Roll for it, though. Nah, I don't know. I'm not sure I would care. Mm. You should fucking care, Terrell. Jeez. I just woke up. He's like, he says, Strahd and Prismy. I was like, I'm. I think he did too for me. So yeah, but he could not be improved. We can't see shit, man. I can see that I'm in. A, I'm in a dungeon shithole. If only you could turn an eleven. And walk through the cells. Would an eleven read anything from him? Hang on. Eleven? No. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. We're not casters. There's hmm. a bard here who is a caster, but the rest of us aren't casters. Okay. Um. <laughs> Where's the bard at? What are you talking Terrell. about? Terrell. Yeah. God, Terrell, you I'm a drunk. Shut up. Uh, your, the cell that you're in has nothing of interest. 
Eisenschmidt, your cell has, because you're kind of like in adjoining cells, um, pounded into the roof of this cell. And it, like, you couldn't tell at first because it was behind you when you kind of got up and looked around the room. Pounded into the roof of this cell is a rusted iron pulley, strung through which is a rope that is tied to one of the cross beams of the barred door. Dangling upside down from the pulley is a man, flabby and stout of build, in tight-fitting leather armor. His boots are bound with rope just below the pulley. His fleshy hands are tied behind his back, and his head is under water. He isn't. I, I want to pull it. Pull the... The, 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 the rope? The rope, yeah. Okay. Maybe investigate uh, the, the hanging give the me real quick. <laughs> well, I want to get. Well, I can see that his head's underwater, right? Yeah. So I want to try to pull the rope and just get his head underwater, and hopefully that's enough rope to maybe like tie like a quick knot, so at least his head's not like drowning. Give me a strength check. No, I'm good at those. <laughs> I actually got a nat 20. That's a natural 20. All right. So I have zero strength. <laughs> you go to pull on the rope. Hopefully you and just breaks you start it, making some, <coughs> some leeway. And um, with the movement of the, the body, you notice that the rope tightens tighter around his legs, like chunky legs. Mm -hmm. And it actually cuts into the, the rotting flesh around his feet and his like he falls into the water and his feet are still okay on so the he's dead bro. okay that's fine <laughs> he's <laughs> long dead I tried. and I tried. Gross. I tried. super I tried. gross I tried. you can see now this is really nasty water um it's more than one dead body in it but when you kind of walk around you you feel something move with your with your uh, feet and it is a uh, it's a loot broken loot. This is the cell where they keep bards. <laughs> it's got a real, real, um, real problem with bards. Imp. <laughs> Let's see. Which one Ooh, are you in? Okay. <coughs> You're set. Be sit down. That'd be a <laughs> You get that. Sit fuck down. In your cell, shackled to the back wall of the cell is an emaciated figure in a blue robe, its spindly arms spread wide and its head tilted forward. Long gray hair hangs down in front of the dead man's face. Yeah. Cool. Uh, you can see puncture marks uh, in the wizard's neck. Uh, um, real quick, have I had a long rest at this point? That's what I was about to ask, is how, how yes. do I feel? Uh, you are long rested, you have full health. We're going to go back over to the Abbey. Cool! Uh, here, in, here, here real quick, so you can kind of ponder your current state of affairs. Back at the Abbey. <laughs> I'm right. Abbott, what the fuck going on with my friends? Where'd they go? Where are they? Straw it's a made. cell about uh, bowling balls. <laughs> but there is like more for like $70. Okay, kind of gathered that part. And where they are is anyone's guess, but presumably they are we see in the castle. They were captured by Strahd really and are somewhere within the castle. Presumably in the dungeons. I don't know. Um, God. I swear I would never go back. If you want to save your friends, you might have to. Could you find them? Do you have the ability? See, you have big wings! Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's not as... Uh, useful as you might think in a castle. <laughs> uh, <coughs> you look powerful. Let me see what I can do, says the dungeon master. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <coughs> you sure can. Uh, this is 
quite a predicament with uh, something. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what we're going to do, man. That's what I call a sticky situation. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> well, no, he can. I mean, let me see. Oh, yeah. I wish he I had will. like some sort of knife or something. So that if he will. Because uh, Your teeth. I have rope. And... <laughs> If you have rope, it usually works out really well if you're escaping somewhere. Well, it's a pulley. <coughs> Door. Rope. Pull. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did that. I must now there's feet there. Commune. You pull the body, you pull on the rope. I must commune with no, pull on the rope. Deity. Uh, um, is there the anything else that... You are needing here is like we why? Why did you actually come here? We came for holy symbol. Which in, in, gar in, in garden, uh, look to you are a guardian. I said look to guardian, not garden. Are you not guardian? <laughs> <laughs> I suppose you could say that I'm a guardian of big wings. Habit. Uh, and by the way, at this point, he kind of phases back into his avid. I like to uh, apologize for shooting at you. I, uh, you know, yeah. well, understandable. Okay. okay. I believe you. <laughs> I understand. That's why the first shot was non lethal. Let me uh, know. <laughs> no, I know. I know. I understand. It was a really crazy situation. <laughs> this it happened. Really All right, good. All right. All right. What does it say again? What are you looking for again? Holy symbol. Read it. Right. It's all symbol. Okay, so. Well, I, I just have something about Garden Snow, Scarecrow, Grin, float towards the garden. That's what I have. I see a garden dusted with snow, watched over by a scarecrow with a sackcloth grin. Look not to the garden, but to the guardian. What's the. I'm going to pull out his book from, from my bag that I lifted off him earlier and read that to him. The Tome of Straw? Well, no, he, he wrote it. He wrote down his the predictions, right? In game. Who had the tome of Strahd? Me. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Slide All hand. right. Slide hand. Bob. No. No. It's, it's too late. late. Uh, it's too late. late. <laughs> Behind you. Because I made sure right that I got something out of this, and I thought it'd be cool. We will get to that, and why kind of what happened with that. But did he write down the predictions in game, or is it just out of game that he does that? Uh, it should have been noted, but you probably didn't get them like word for word. That's why I wrote no, it down. No, because I wrote it real fast. Yes, yeah. so. that's why I wrote it down. So well, you, what's you relay the prophecy thing? Okay, and then to the, the other the one, anime. the other one then that I'm questioning is the uh, Vistana. The Vistana one? Yeah. A Vistana wanders this land alone, searching for her mentor. She does not stay in one place for long. Seek her out at St. Markovia's Abbey near the mists. Okay. So that's that's the other thing. <sighs> so I relay both of those two. Okay. Yeah. That's that's what I've been that's the one that's been kind of getting you have been seeing the Vistana have you. I did not uh, I came to party late. Well, okay. They did. I don't know what's going on. I would... Well, shit, you totally know what's going on. I don't know. I don't, I don't even know why we're at this damn abbey. Because the, of these. these. I don't things. know. I wasn't here when you all got those well, either. The, okay, so when they first got them, into so. Barovia, they saw, met up with this Vistana fortune teller who gave them clues on how they could defeat Strahd. And that's here. That's what they're... That's, that's why they're... That's why you are in the Abbey. And right technically, now. there are two things that we should ah, possibly do here. You must. You speak of Irina. I'm not here. So I can I get her for you. She's in the sure. other wing. Oh God. Um, before, of course, I'll, God for I'll need to commune first, and then I'll get back to you on where your friends are. That's good. I need. Uh, if you're looking for the garden, the garden is to the south. I say south. Is that south? Hang on. To your right on the big map that's covered up right now. It is actually to the east. Okay. It's east. There's a there's a guard house there. Just go to the garden. Please don't take anything from there. Uh, 
food wise. I mean, I, I use that food to feed the Mongol folk. <laughs> oh. Uh, thank you. You do realize those mongrels are abominations to nature. He doesn't. But they live. Yeah, yeah. He didn't do it. <laughs> He's helping them. Uh. So we have different yes, we have different viewpoints oh, on this it? though. Yeah, he You're did it. Him. He did it to save their lives. Oh. But see, I also feel it's abomination to, towards nature, and they all need to die now. Wow, it's pretty intense. He Please don't kill I'm, I'm not going to kill, kill anything. I respectfully easy. request that you do not. I won't. <laughs> they are generally. I'm just I'm just bringing it to your attention as as the druid of like the them. party. I feel I have to say they are abominations that towards fox nature. Spiders. <laughs> I unfortunately will have to agree with you. Uh, keep those just for the sake of names, in case you need it. Not relevant right now, but to the they're they're names. Okay. Names. Okay. Cool. Got it. Uh, let's see here. Do you head out to the garden while he's doing his thing? Getting yeah. everything prepared? Okay. Yeah, so, yeah. nestled between rising and plunging cliffs are four rectangular garden plots enclosed by a five foot high wall of mortared stones. White rabbits nibble on turnips uprooted by the cold. Two lifeless scarecrows with stuffed gullets and sackcloth heads hang from wooden crosses pounded into the cold hard earth. So there are two scarecrows in this area. Uh, oh, wait, what are we looking <coughs> Do we know what we're looking for here? No. No, oh, okay. <coughs> well, we're looking for a holy symbol, but that's about it. Yeah. Also, yes. we lost Can a few you party locate members. objects on a holy symbol? Uh, do you know what it looks like? Or what it even is? I, I don't know. I've missed most of this. I would say probably not. Okay. Uh, let me look something up real quick, and then we'll jump into that. There are only two options, so you can check both of the scarecrows. It's not like it's, not like it's a, super, a huge long search. Super time-consuming thing. Right. I'll take the one on the right. I'll take the left. <laughs> Let's throw a grenade. Yeah. Investigation. <laughs> but uh, let's let's not take the Bolshevik muppet option. It's a rock, actually. So that's what I throw. <laughs> and I look at you. I'm like, no, nah, I don't have grenades. That's him. Which we gotta get our party Ooh. members back to. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. I went to the one on the right. Again, I'm searching the left one. Let me check the of the southernmost. That'll be walking in. Okay, the one on the left or right. Okay. Oh, right. He went right. Okay. So give me investigation checks. Couldn't be simple. Well, wait, wait, with advantage, because oh. there's only so much. I'll roll again. Okay. But with advantage. No. Yeah. Okay. That's a thirteen. Not a nineteen. 13. Nice. Cool. No, I'm sorry. That's a seventeen. Nice. Or. Or a uh, 24. Nice. <laughs> Got it. So, uh, well, you find within the scarecrow a holy symbol. Oh. It looks like this. Oh, that so, looks like something we need. <laughs> Sun-ish symbol. It is called, <coughs> curiously enough, I'll reiterate this. Uh, the holy symbol of oh, raven yeah. kind. Well, I mean, in the oh! book. And you find it. <laughs> You're like, nice. Let me get some information here. How much time do we have? About five minutes. Okay, cool. With 80 seconds. Oh, <coughs> right. five minutes with 80 seconds. That's like six. Minutes. That was exactly when I said it. Six minutes seconds. All right, so this has 10 charges. This is five. I'm putting math. this on right now. Hey, no, that was a math trickery. I could have read it exactly, Actually, all right? <laughs> uh, let me, let me get this pulled up. Oh, if it's a holy symbol, it probably requires a good alignment that it's not me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm still going to put it on. I mean, I don't see how I'm a raven. Wrong. I steal shiny things. <laughs> and that yeah. one has your name on it. Yeah. <laughs> That's what ravens do. Ravens and crows, they steal shiny, shiny shit. Mostly crows. Yeah, crows can use like vending machines. 
Oh. They're really fucking smart birds. Crows mm. understand equivalent exchange. They give gifts for food. You know crows can talk to you, too? Mm-hmm. All right. We're getting off track. Crows. I was giving him time. Crows. To get you know they yeah. also yeah. protect oh, all right. the wall. Like, <laughs> I love the crows. This has to be. Uh, all right. So a couple things about this, which we'll fast forward a little bit and say. That, uh, wait. Does anyone have identify or <laughs> probably the druid might? Uh, I do. You do? You're not there. Yeah, uh, but there. you're not fucking there. <laughs> Let me see. You're in there in spirit. Identify. Yeah. Okay. It's a what first level, level is it? Second level, I'm sorry. Uh, I, but I have more spells there. Yeah. I was just searching it on my phone. Yeah, I don't have it. I don't have it. It's alphabetical, so. Uh, do you want to try to attune to it? Yeah, why the fuck not? No. Oh, fuck right. yeah. I want it so bad. Okay, so you try... Because um, it's going to take... The abbot's going to come get you from the guard once he has information. So you see, he'll, he'll see it on my chest. I'm not, yeah. I'm not putting so, it under my clothes. So you put it on, and you take a few minutes, kind of a short rest, length of time-ish. Well, not quite that long, but you start to attune yourself to this, or try to anyway. And it's just not happening. I it's shake not, it. I look at the demo. Is this broken? <laughs> He's not outside yet. It's out. Uh, when he gets out there, that's okay. exactly okay. what I'm going to ask him. For five, you have to be lost. So dead. eventually, I would Just say in about five yeah. minutes, the abbot steps out from the uh, like through through the gate into the garden with a uh, woman following him. Not not Sally. Not. Not Velisca, but God dang it, this book is so confusing. Confusing. You gotta read the whole thing and memorize every page. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> All of it. Damn it! <laughs> All right. This is why homebrew is easier. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. I was so excited to do Strahd. I can't wait for Storm King. You guys are getting the uh, Storm King Thunder. It's gonna be dope. I want to. I want to run the sun for somebody. Oh. Boop. Mm-hmm. Down for that too. I'm trying to see. There it is. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> you were so excited for it. Too. There it is. Nope. Ah. Uh, okay. <laughs> Your investigation check was an out. Yeah, well, no, it was close, but. This song's really similar to Adachio for strings, by the way. Oh, that's cool. Yes. Which is the saddest song ever written. <laughs> but yeah. this is also a sad song. That's really similar. What is... Not me in the saddest song. If you want to go ahead... We're going to go Adachio ahead and end this Yeah, we're, we're... And just uh, past I will... Uh, I'm going to also take a break and I'll get some stuff. All right. Rounded up here. Have a good... Take a question. Second. The garden...